Okay, good day mga fathers. Uh, uh, let me uh, share once again to you how the code defines the meaning and the application of uh, the 80% OCPT rating design na madalas nating ginagamit sa ating field at sa ating mga design. Okay, dito po natin makikita ang 80% niya sa PEC 2.30 8.9 the protection requirements uh, yeah, dito po sa uh, kanyang uh, A this one yan po dito sa A enclosed uh, overcurrent devices let me read this to you the restriction to 80% of the rating for an enclosed overcurrent device for continuous loads shall not apply to overcurrent devices installed in the systems operating at over 600 voltage So, ang 80% pala natin dito ay dito natin in-apply sa mga enclosed overcurrent devices uh, na hindi siya lumalagpas sa uh, 600 volt at ito ay uh, sa for, ma, for continuous uh, mga continuous load lamang ayon dito sa PEC. Okay, let's let's go over with the, the next slide here. Ito po yung uh, tinatanong na enclosed ang mga circuit breaker natin dahil dito sa enclosed na to ay uh, napaka-significance ng 80% ma OCPD uh, uh, application ng maximum uh, load ng current dito dahil ito ay uh, naka mainit ito pag nasa loob na wala itong exhaust so uh, habang uh, in the long span of years ay uh, pwedeng mangyari pag uh, nag-exceed yung ano mo sa 80% ay pwede magkaroon ng fire hazards dito at uh, mga electrocution sa human so kailangan ma-maintain natin yon ang 80% na yon uh, makakalculate natin yon at mapuprove natin based on our succeeding uh, uh, presentation okay ito po yon ang application yan applying an OCPD at 80% of its rating for continuous load accounts for the resulting higher ambient temperatures found when an overcurrent device is contained within an enclosure yan po yan, ang uh, mahalaga yan. Kasi pag nasa loob na yung mga ano natin, hindi na makaka, ano yan, may tataas ang current dyan. Pag uh, medyo siyempre, alam nyo na, may uh, uh, tinatawag tayo na nagiinit ang ano pag wala siyang exhaust na hangin na lumalabas dun sa mga panel board na yan. So prone ang ating mga breaker dyan, tsaka mga wire sizes to overheating or, or uh, whatever. Uh, basta mag-overload siya o mapaprone siya sa uh, mga short circuit o electrocution mga tao. Right, ito naman NEC 2077 215.3 The overcurrent protection device uh, feeder shall be protected against overcurrent in accordance with the position where a feeder supplies continuous loads or any combinations of continuous and non-continuous loads. The rating of the overcurrent device shall not be less than the non-continuous load plus 125% of the uh, continuous load. Uh, ito po yun ang uh, uh, sinasabi ng uh, uh, NEC na wala dun sa PEC na binasa natin kanina. Ito po yung 80% na uh, uh, OCPD rating na meron siyang combination of uh, continuous load and non-continuous loads. Uh, hindi siya dapat uh, bumaba dyan sa dalawa yan kaya mataas siya ang uh, rating niya. Okay, ito naman po may exception dito where the assembly including the overcurrent devices protecting the feeders is listed for operation at 100% of its rating. The ampere rating of the overcurrent device shall be permitted to be less than the sum of the continuous load plus the non-continuous load. So, ang ibig sabihin po rito ay meron tayo ditong sinasabi niya, meron ditong uh, 100% uh, OCPD rating pala ng ano, hindi lang pala itong 80%. Meron ding OC, uh, 100% OCPD uh, rating na circuit breaker. So let's let's get over with this uh, one in, uh, in the succeeding uh, uh, presentation natin. Uh, let's, let's first take a look at this one. Ito din po yung overcurrent protection para naman ito sa uh, branch uh, circuits. Okay, parehas lang po yan doon sa feeder. Parehas lang po yung ano nila. So let's go over with this uh, next one. This is the rule that states that an OCPD can be loaded to only 80% of its rating for continuous load loads. 
okay remember that uh, 80 percent is the inverse of uh, the 125 percent uh, which means 0 0.8 equals to 1 divided by 1.25 ano ba ang ibig sabihin yan ang ibig sabihin po nito na yung 80 percent pala ay isa size up natin ang uh, OCPD to 125 percent which is uh, the 125 percent of the continuous load and the non -contain continuous load yun po ang ibig sabihin niyan so halos parehas na siya sila may identical in their end requirement okay let me compare to you the uh, comparison of the 80% and the 100% OCPD ratings design comparisons and definition sa 80% sa OCPD rating po ay meron pa as per code ito yung sum ng uh, binasa natin kanina na 100% ka 25 continuous load at 100% na non-continuous load or both, the combination of both so kung anything na merong uh, uh, continuous load ay uh, i-apply natin ang 80% uh, uh, OCPD uh, design rating uh, ito ay uh, may plus factor sa 125 dun sa OCPD size ang wire size nito ay 125% din ang uh, sizing niya so pareya sila ano ba yung mga continuous load na yon yung mga continuous load na yon ay yun yung mga appliances mga equipment or mga lights na nag operate uh, uh, more than uh, 3 hours at their maximum rated uh, current so dito naman sa 100% OCPD ito po yun ang uh, hindi natin alam na siguro marami sa atin na akala 80% lang ang circuit breaker rating natin meron po tayong 100% dito sa ano ito ay mga UL standard listed na mga circuit breaker coming from uh, America yata ito na UL standard for 8.9 as ya governed and tested so ed, medyo mahal ito uh, ang, ang, ang 100% na ito ito naman ay ina-apply sa mga non-continuous load ano yung mga non-continuous load ay yun yung mga equipment o mga appliances o mga anything na hindi uh, na lumalagpas ang kanilang operation sa more than 3 hours or mga sa startup lang o like the receptacles o yung mga ano natin dyan mga electric fan, TV, hindi naman ganong nana yan eh. nagagamit ng uh, 3 hours yan but the definition of this 100% uh, is actually hindi na highlight gano dyan sa NEC so uh, uh, let's, let's, let's go over to the next uh, slide here and let's take the example if the load of the brown circuit is a continuous load and calculated to be 100 amperes uh, magsisimula talaga tayo sa mga calculation natin muna ng mga uh, kung anong load ng current natin sa ating design or sa, sa application mas sa field uh, okay ang NEC uh, actually uh, the NCC 2017 revised edition requires the OCPD rating to be 120% or 1 over 0 0.8 times so the 100% of the calculated continuous loads current it defines as uh, yung binasa natin kanina sa code okay ito namang OCPD na to uh, device operating for this example is calculated as follows OCPD rating meron tayong 175 na uh, uh, 125 uh, na continuous load uh, uh, at 100 amperes so uh, meron tayong uh, which gives us the 125 amperes so ang 80% ng uh, 125 na yan ay itong 100 amperes okay when we multiply 0.8 to uh, 125 amperes so ito yung maximum na 80% load natin okay ayang 100 amperes na yan na dapat hindi tayo lumagpas dyan para masunod natin ang code at uh, for safety yan ang safe uh, na pinaka safe load na dapat natin ano yun sa mga enclosed na mga breaker or mga panel board okay now next is uh, okay this is the 80% number percentage okay ito yung mga pinaka uh, uh, equation niya okay take a look at this na kinuha natin yung 80% na 175 meron tayong 100 load na amperes na continuous load at uh, divide natin sa OCPD rating natin so ang lumabas niyan is 80% so yung 80% na na rule ay nakabase rito sa equation na ito 
Okay. Let's go. Okay, the equation for the calculating naman, the selection of the conductors which ultimately will drive the selection of CSPD as is follows. Take note that in the preceding calculation method, the 125% appears in the equation and anything, uh, a combination of load involves a continuous load, we shall apply the 80%. So, kung meron mang continuous load dyan sa combination, kailangan natin i-apply ang 80%. Where most of our application in the field and in our design is a 95% ay nakatuon dito sa 80% application sa mga load current. So kung tayo ay mag-size up ng kanyang OCPD at saka no, kailangan meron siyang uh, 125% dito sa continuous load. Okay, para may size up natin doon sa 80%. Ayan po yung function. Ito po yung equation if the load current is calculated 100%. Pag 100% naman ang gagamitin natin na OCP device rating, uh, kailangan wala siyang makikita ang 100% dito. Kasi we are going to size the, the OCPD and the wire size at 100% rating. Okay. So, kung ano yung uh, size mo sa OCPD, yun din ang size mo sa uh, wire mo, 100%. Magkaiba ito doon sa 80%. Kaya, mas advantage yung 80% kasi uh, nasa size up natin ng uh, kanilang OCPD to 125%, both for wires and the OCPD. Okay, then this is the example, the load in the branch circuit is a continuous sa 100 amps. Okay, meron tayong continuous 100 amps. I-apply natin ang 80%. Okay, the load current continues, so, so we have the 135, so we uh, multiply the 300 parts, that it's a continuous load, we multiply it uh, by 125, uh, we, it gives us the 300 amperes. Okay, the conductor size of this 375 is uh, 250 according to the, to, according to uh, 3.10 uh 1675 C degrees using the 75 uh, degree table which sizes up at uh, it can carry uh, it can carry a 375 amperes yung 250 mm squared natin so ang standard natin at 80 rated at 80% rated circuit breaker ay we go uh, wala tayong standard na 375 so we go up to the next standard which is the 400 based on the P240.1.6 uh, uh, mayroong uh, 400 ang kasunod nyan so ang 80% maximum allowed mo dyan ay itong 320 based dito sa 400 so 80% times the 400 which will give you the 320 amperes ito yung 80% na maximum load mo para hindi ka mag-violate uh, dun sa 80% na OCPD rating maximum allowed. Okay? Example number 2 ay meron tayong feeder uh, 200 amps continuous and 100 amps on the content continuous. We shall size up the opposite at 100% rated current design as well as the wire sizes. So take note na uh, the 125% is not included in the uh, equation because we are going to size this up at 100%. So, the load current, non-continuous plus uh, continuous load, ay walang mga 125. So, 100 plus 200, even though that is a, a continuous load, pero uh, magsasize up tayo ng breaker na 100% OCPD rating. So, it gives us the 300 ampere. Amperes, okay? So, that one will uh, give us a, a wire size of 175 mm squared conductors, which can carry a 305 Amperes at sa 100% rated circuit breaker natin uh, dahil uh, ito, ay, uh, meron, ito ay standard na sa 300 sa PD ano, ito na yung pinaka oh, CPD natin itong 300 amperes kasi standard na sa sa uh, PEC uh, 240.16 okay so let's go to the uh, next one Okay, ito yung uh, gagamitin nating uh, table para sa sizing ng wire natin. Uh, na kanina nakita na sa 75, meron tayong ditong 375. Okay, ang size niya is 175 mm squared. So, you just read it out. 
and uh, uh, this is the standard rating for the fix and the ano kanina na ano natin merong 400 ok 375 then wala naman tayo 375 then uh, we go for the 400 so it's just uh, uh, with that one ok forget it